Hey friends, let's learn Unskinny Bop by Poison and we're tuned to E flat, let's jump straight in. So for our intro, we're just gonna hit the third fret harmonic on the G string and pull up on our bar. And then we have this main riff, we're gonna play an A power chord. And then on the A string, three, hammer on to four. And then on the D string, two, four, G, two. And then start on the G, do four, pull off the two, pull off the open. Same on the D. And then A, four, G, two. And then we're just gonna play the bottom part of a G chord. We're just playing the G, B, and E string two times. And then finish on a D chord. And do that two times for our intro. So let's do that up to speed. And then for our verse, we just keep repeating that riff for another four times, and then we have our pre-chorus. Let's have a look at that. We have the open E, seventh fret A, pull off to the open, open E, fifth fret A, open E, seventh fret, pull off to the open again on the A, and then play the open E, third fret E, and then again bend it. Then repeat that all again, O, seven, pull off the O, O, five, O, seven, pull off the O, O, and this time jump to the D string fifth fret with a pinched harmonic. And just do that two times and that's our pre-chorus. And that's our pre-chorus and we have our chorus, let's do that. So for our chorus, we start on the A. This time play the open A string, hammer on to three, hammer on to four, go to D, two, four, G, two, bend on four with a pinched harmonic. Then just play four, two, and then do another bend with a pinched harmonic, bend and release, pull off to two. And then just play G two times, open D and G, and then D two times. Then go back to that first riff again, A, open three, four, two, four, two. This time do the bend and the pinched harmonic on the four. Then just play four, two. Then our G, two times, and this time D, D sus four, back to D. Then do the first riff again, so the A, four, two, pull off to the two, and then the G, D. Then to finish that off, we're coming up to an E chord, so just open E, 7, 9, and 9, and palm muting 2, and 3, and 4, and, and then open E, 2, open E, 3, open E, 4, open E, 5, and that's our first chorus, let's play that now. first and played exactly the same except we put this one little fill in. We're going to bend on the 19 on the G and play 17 on the B and then play 17 E. Do 20 pull off the 17 on the B. G 19 back to B 17 do a bend on 20 B and then go back to the G 19 bend release pull off the 17. D 19 G 19 to 17. And that's the only difference there. Let's play that. Then from there we have our next pre-chorus and the only change is here is we're going to add in another little fill. We're going to bend on 19 on the G and hold 17 B and do that two times. Instead of doing the three. And that's the only difference there. Then we have our next chorus. Then for our next chorus the only change is our end. We don't do that, we come from the E and we play the G. Then you play third fret on the E, fourth fret on the E. So from that E there. And that's the only difference there. And then we go into our bridge, so let's have a look at that. So then our bridge, we start on the D, play that, hold, 
and then D string two hammer on to four, G string two hammer on to four, play the B three, do a bend and release on five and pull off to three. Then just play an A power chord, play the open A string force, pull off the two on the D, play four on the A and then four and two on four on the D, two on the G and back to two and two D and G. So. Then repeat the first one again on the D. This time go A, then we're going to go on F sharp over D, back to A, repeat the first one again, and then play A, 2, slide up to 4 on the A string, 2 on the D, play the E string 3, pull off the open, go back to 3, and then just do the build up on the E power chord, and the same end as our first chorus. Open two, open three, open four, open five. So let me play that bridge for you. solo and we'll do that at the end let's do our solo rhythm first so we have an A hold for four a G hold for two and then the D hold for two do that three times and then we just have our E build up again play our G three on the E four on the E and that's our solo rhythm there so let's do that part right after the solo we're going to be on the E string two slide up to three and play three another two more times do that again two slide up to three and then play three slide up to five so we have do a slide do that again now just play two and two on D and G do the first one again slide then we've got this last little bit, we're going to play the A on the 5th fret, 1, 2, 3, back to the 3rd fret, do a bend on the 5th fret A, 3rd fret, and then 5th fret on the A, and then do our G, and then we're going to do 2 times on the 3rd fret, and on the 4th fret, and that's our little part after the solo, so let's do that up to speed. For our last chorus, we do the first part of the riff again, the A, G, G, D, D. Now this one changes a little bit to the start the same, A, 2, and when we get to the 4, just do 4 bends, 1, 2, 3, 4, and then G, G, D, then do the first one again. This one's going to change again, we're going to play the A, the O, 3, 4, 2, 4, 2, bend on the 4. Then we're going to come up to the E string, play 12, pull off to 9 and come in with your bar and just repeat that. And come back to 2G, bend on 4, back to 2. Then we do the riff again, A, open 3, 4, 2, 4, to 2 on the G and this time we're going to do Similar to our verse, G, 4, 2, open, pull off, D the same, G, D, go back to the G two times, and then do it again, G, 4, 2, open, D, 4, 2, open, go to A, 3, 2, open, 
back to D, 4-2 opens. Then do our riff again, our A. And then G, G, D, D. And we're pretty much faded out by then, so let's do that up to speed. parts and it's faded out by then. Now let's do the solo. So for our solo we're starting with a pinched harmonic and a bend on the 20th fret on the B. Do it again. Another two times and then just do the bend without the pinched harmonic. Then we're going to do a run down B. 20, 19, 17, 20, 17. G, 20. B, 17. Back to G. 20, 19, 17. 19, 17, 16, 17, 16. D 19, G 16, back to D, 19, 17, 19, 17, 16, 17, 16, and then to the A 19, and then we're just running back up. 16, 17, 19, G, 16, 17, 19, to the B, 17, 19, 20, and bend on 20 there. Then we're going to use our whammy bar, start with an in, do a bend on 14 G, and let the whammy bar come out. Do that again. Then we have another little run. We've got 17 on the E, pull off to 14. B, 17, E, 14, back to B, 17, 14. Then do the same, but B, 17, pull off to 14. G, 16, B, 14, G, 16, 14. G, 16, pull off to 14. D, 16, G, 14. Back to D, 16, 14, 16, and then 14 on the G there. And then he slides back on that 14, and then we're coming up to a bend on the 22nd fret on the E. And then play it again and do a bend, release, bend, release, bend, release. Then we have this last little run. We've got 22, 20, 19, all on the E. 20, 19, 17, B, 20, 19, 17, G, 19, 17, D, 19, 17, A, 19, 17, slide back to 15. Now we're going to use our bar, we're going to play the note and push in on the bar. 17, 19, D, 16, 17, 19, G, 16, 17, 19, B, 17, 19, 20, E, 17, 19, 20, and then do a bend on 22 to finish it off, and then we go straight back to our... And that finishes the solo off, so let's do that up to speed. So I hope you enjoyed this. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you soon.